Neighborhoods Archon. Tell us a very fast story. What up, peeps? It's your friendly neighborhood yep, Archon Kai here. <laughs> I had to turn him up. <laughs> nice. Thank you. <laughs> Perfect. All right, That's everyone, about as loud let's, as I get. Let's, let's go up into the sky for a while and do our little intro stuff. Oh, okay. Let's yeah. fly. Welcome to Craftwork Season 2, everybody. Woo! One, two, three. Punch trees! Punch trees! Punch trees! Punch trees. Punch trees. Punch trees. Punch trees. And that is how we started season two of Craftworks, and and punch trees we did. We managed to get everyone together, the group of the new crafters and the existing crafters, and we all pulled together to build something special. And that something special was a place we called Spawnville. Um, the idea behind Spawnville was that we would all build our bases nice and close together, uh, so that we could get it a bit easier to have interactions and things like that. In season one, we found that once we spread out, we had a few issues. We were still spread out, but at least for the start of season two, we'd all be really nice and close together and, and have that real community sort of feel. And uh, yeah, so Spawnville was born. We initially separated into three different groups for doing this. We had a terraforming group, we had a mining group, and we had a food group. And uh, unfortunately, with the beginning of Minecraft being so difficult, particularly when there's a massive group of people trying to work together, uh, I think the mining group became the dying group, and the food group, they managed to get some food together. Unfortunately, by the time they'd done that, the sort of terraforming group had managed to go off and get their own food as well. But anyway, we all pulled together and we managed to get this this huge area cleared and get it ready for people to start putting down bases. And man, they did it fast. I logged off for a little while. Um, I wasn't feeling the best still. And yeah, logged off for a couple of hours, came back on and it felt like everyone was almost finished. It was crazy how fast people were putting out their builds and things like that. Um, I'll let this little time lapse here finish and then I'm going to show you over some of what went on. And this here, this is spawn. This is what we ended up with. So um, let me, I'll, I'll step out into free cam a little bit. Unfortunately, so, no, wait. A lot has gone on, right? A lot, we, we have obviously skipped from, well, we'll dig a few things up to this point in time. Now, the reason why it's gone to this point in time, so I don't play with the same urgency as some other people. There's one person particularly back down this way. Um, and this is his house here. And I don't think he's shown that house, so we're not going to show a lot of it. But Lucky Lane is the fastest Minecrafter I have ever ah, seen. During the morning now, maybe. Okay. And I'll um, maybe work a little bit on the house. Oh, <laughs> I have right. to finish it. Oh, oh, Don't sit on the what to do with people, the people now, back there. Um, Shh. We'll, we'll move away. We'll move away. So, so ordinarily, I would say that Millie is the fastest uh, player of the game. Um, but, but realistically, I mean, Lane and Jitterybug—they're two of the absolute fastest. And E, in fact, everyone on this server is massively fast, except me. I'm not fast. Um, so, so what I want to do, I want to show you a couple of things before I take you into what I've been doing. Um, so some of this isn't going to be in the correct order, but that's okay. So let me, let me take you on a bit of a tour and show you around a little bit of what we're, what we're doing, right? So, so as I said, we'll go free cam up. Let's have a look. Um, so, so this is spawn, right? This is what we were doing. This is the, the whole area that we were talking about. So this area in the middle here, this is where people will spawn if they haven't set a spawn on a bed or whatever. Um, or if you die in a horrible accident. And then the idea was going to be that you, if, if that happened, if you died, then you could just run over to your house and pick up some stuff and then you could go to wherever you need to go. Now, people will 
branch off into the great blue yonder. Um, but we, but you know, for now we're all nice and close, and it's really good. It's it's a really good feeling. Um, now, I as for things that I have done. Um, now, do I have a? I do have a bed with me. I'll show you a couple of things before we get into my main my main base, which you've already seen from the thumbnail anyway. But uh, but let's um, let's just take this and we'll go for a little bit of a run. We'll just go down here past these. I always like. I, I just love that because like these guys are so be noisy. Better better uh, rates. That they're so well, noisy. These. These guys are Hello, so Zink. noisy. Hello, Toblox. How are you going? Hey, Good Inca. Man. I'm just recording Hello. a bit for my for my audience, just showing them that. Let's, let's look at Toblox's <laughs> place. Let's all criticize Toblox's house heavily. <laughs> yeah, it has no roof. I'm gonna leave this in my <laughs> so, uh, in the little was... uh, the room, and then I am gonna log off. I'm tired. Okay. Inca. Right. See you, well. Inca. Bye bye. See ya. Adios. Bye bye. See bye bye. <laughs> Yeah, I, I I was about like to get mad at you because you slept because it was it was raining and I was about to go fishing. Oh, I've ruined <laughs> then it. Then I thought, well, I'm not gonna do this because I have I don't have a roof, so it's raining into my house. So thank you for yeah, sleeping. Yeah, that's things. terrible. Why did you? <laughs> why don't you have a roof in your house? <laughs> I haven't built one yet. Yeah, yeah, I'm a bit the same yeah. way, you know. Like I just just you know do the outside bit and that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's, it's like work in progress here. And um, yeah, it's... I need to figure out. I was like talking to Inca what hmm. what kind of roof style I want to have and what kind of blocks I want to use. And uh, I was about to think about bamboo, maybe like a ooh, yellowish tone. And, that'd be different. Uh, maybe ac acacia wood, like an orange tone. Uh, okay. So that's, that's what I thought. Uh. Yeah, it's not the walls are not finished yet. No. Uh, I have to detail them. Yep. Yeah, uh, like like in the front here. Yep, like with the birch and the birch and the calcite and, and stuff. Polished yeah. And, yeah. Yeah. yeah, yep. So mm. that's what I gotta do. But um, mm. yeah, it's a good combo. I really really like the birch with calcite and diorite. Yeah, me thing. too. Yeah, yeah, it I looks, love that too. Looks really nice. Yeah. Mm. Well, yeah, excellent. So, You're doing really well, Tobox. It's, it's fantastic. Thank you. Well. So I need to keep going because I'm trying to get an episode done. So I, okay, I need but, to but pretend you, like I'm think, showing think, people think, things. Think, yes. Think, think. Come over here. Come yes. here. Yeah, yeah. Uh, walk. Stand there where the torch is. The torch on the birch slab. Just stand there. Just, just here. Yeah. It's, it's. Yeah, yeah. It's. Yeah. Just, just stay there. Just here. Just stay there. Just yeah, here. Yeah, just there. Mm -hmm. uh, wait. I come over to you. All right. Just stay there. Yeah. Right. That's perfect. Mm. Oh. Thank you. Why would you no, do no, that? No, 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 I don't no, want to. Stay there, stay there. No, I don't want to get. It's, I've probably got an arrow in my butt now. I, see, now look what you've done. You've made them upset. Uh, look at me. Look at me. Oh, you got it. <laughs> in your eyes. Oh, in my eyes. Nice. It's, yeah, it's, nice. It's, it's, it's in between you. Uh, yeah. Oh, thank it you. is too. Thank you, I think. That's lovely. Yeah, thanks. All right, Tobes. <laughs> I'll speak so thank to you for your service. <laughs> um, I have to tame the pillager. I don't know who put it there. Yes. I think he just ended up with the uh, tamed pillager. So yeah. Um, I see. Um, and I think he just ended up in the boat and had to tame it as well. Do you know so whose cat this thank is? Thank you for you. Nope. This cat and I have nope. been playing a, a game of tag since um, since spawn. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm going now. <laughs> see ya. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, Zink. Bye. 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 Okay, so yeah, so that that was a bit of fun. It was good to see Toblox out in the wild. Now here we have a Nether portal. Do I have anything gold? I mean, no. We're just going to risk this. So this is the Nether portal, the main one for the server at the moment. Uh, and anything, anything going to kill me? No. All right, we're safe. We're safe. Um, so just down this way, I built one of my world famous XP farms. They are they are world famous, and yeah, I mean it's completely one hundred percent my own design. Uh, no one else's design. Just no, it's this thing again. I've done. Oh, it's like the twins out of The Shining. Come play with us. That's frightening. Um, 
So, yeah, so this is, this is one of those XP farms. Look at how pretty it is. Do you like that? Do you like the birch on the top and it's all sort of uneven and things? It's beautiful. It's a two-story. Um, so I think I've, I've shown these many times. Let's just show. So inside we've just got platforms. There are no cats, no nothing. Just platforms inside here with trapdoors along the edges and then water down below and everything falls down. And when it gets down to the bottom there, then you can just run up here and just do that and just, just kill them, get loads and loads and loads of XP. Um, we decided, Oda and myself decided that it would be a great place for a um, enchanting setup, and it is. All the twins are out now. They're, they're, it's so spooky. Um, so um, spawn is just over that way. Um, which we can't see. So we're going to head back there. Um, I'm going to take you into a time lapse of what I've done and a little bit of an interruption. Oda and I went on a bit of a journey. So, um, so we're going to do both of those things. Let me show you them. <laughs> Okay, Yoda, as you know, we have been searching high and low, trying to get a hold of a warm ocean. We need coral. Yeah, several people have been scouting for this, and we can't find any. All right. I reckon our best bet is to the, is it northeast? Is that the correct thing, or am I looking at it the wrong way? Is it the southwest? <laughs> I think it's south. East? Southeast? Are you talking about where the desert is? Yes. That direction. You know the direction? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I believe it is southeast. Let southeast. Okay. Map. South Let's look. That's that's east, I believe. The sun is setting to the something. I know I know all these facts, right? Um <laughs> <laughs> Let me sleep. Um We know there's a desert down there. And mm. I reckon it's our best bet to find it. It's a long way. Like we're going to have to journey for many days and nights. It, the, the, the trip will be treacherous. There will be... Who knows what things we'll encounter on the way. But I think we should right. go and try and find this thing. All right, let's do it. Have, I need to uh, you got some, just go get some gear. I was going to say get some food, get some gear. And... Uh, Let's do this thing. Now, the good thing about me saying the wrong direction is I knew which direction I had to go, but I just didn't know which direction it was. <laughs> <laughs> if that makes Oh, look at Mr. Diamond over here. Hello, Mr. Look Diamond. At look at you. Aren't you all fancy? <laughs> That's right. Well, there you go. Yeah, I've been okay. I've been busy in the mines. Yeah, yeah, I have too, but I just hid all my diamonds. 
<laughs> I refuse to spend them. I do have some diamond stuff with me, but yeah. Uh, do I have arrows? Oh, plenty of arrows and a good bow. Yeah. All right. I've got some arrows. Okay. So now I do know that mm. um, Inca has a portal, a nether portal, that will take us at least to like the top part of that desert. Okay. Now, how so safe maybe, is the nether section of it? Of, um, this part, parts of it are a little treacherous. <laughs> we got, so now you're telling me I need to have at least one gold piece of gear with me. Oh, you know what? That's probably not a bad idea. I should do the same thing. All right. Okay, I will put Get on that. a gold helmet because that's you know, that's my choice. So look at this pair of boots that I got out of the skeleton spawner. Isn't that pretty insane? Uh -huh. Oh, what? And all I had to do was just combine it with a regular pair of boots to give it the full health. That That's how it came out enchanted. Could Isn't you fancy with you? Well, my golden helmet has protection four, but everything else Ooh. has nothing on it. So, <laughs> <laughs> so no right, jumping well, hopefully, or high things. <laughs> that's right. Hopefully we'll be well protected from the um, the desert. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah. The desert's <laughs> hot sands or something. Oh, look. He actually has, like, gold gear up here if people need it. That's nice. Good. Nice. Okay, so I think... Okay, this is the only way out. <laughs> I think we just start, like, walking... I believe it's that way over this really precarious, scary bridge. Awesome! Oh, geez, I like the feel <laughs> of this. I uh, this is this is high on my yes, yeah. Um, <laughs> let me just put a shield on because you know that's a good idea. There is a, this thing that floats around in the Never that I'm a real big fan of, <laughs> and um, <laughs> without Swiss sneak, any. it's so slow. <laughs> okay, I think we're safe. All right. I'm going for it. Go for it. I'm worried that I'm going to have a coughing fit and just fall off the edge. <laughs> oh gosh. I think this might be an even scarier staircase. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. I love every bit of this. Um, um, problem? Yes. It's just, it's like blocked off. Now I don't know if this is the right way or not. Okay. <laughs> um, well. Does it, does it continue? It also oh, it goes oh, down. Okay. It also goes down. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, where? You know what? This is going. Okay. It's going south. Yeah. Okay. That's all right. Yeah. Oh, I nearly looked at that Enderman. Oh, so close. See, now you have to decide between gold helmet or pumpkin. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I don't need pumpkin. Um, okay, well, we might so have let's... to. We might have to do it the old-fashioned way. Yeah, we might have to. Hmm. We can look real quick to see if he made some other way to get up to his. Oh, <gasps> careful! Oh, shh, Hoda. I hate the nether. <laughs> I really hate the nether. Yes. I'm running. Go. I'm running straight. Yep. I don't think this is it. All right, let's no. just go over land. Go over land? <laughs> hmm. Well, that was a fun adventure. That's... That was awesome. <laughs> I'm so glad we're not going to be using the nether. Yes. <laughs> Good. Okay. Excellent. All right. So we have to head so that way. Go southeast. We could probably just go pretty much just straight southeast. Yeah. Always think I should have brought um, I should have brought bones with me just in case I find one of those black wolves because I really want one of the black wolves mm. um, and then I think but then I'd have to get it all the way back 
Like, <laughs> <laughs> right. And that's not this adventure is not for trying to get that to happen. <laughs> um, we could go round it to the. It looks like if we go round to the um, yeah, to the south the side of it, maybe. Yeah, might, might be easier. Okay. Well, there's a villager outpost down. A uh, pillager outpost down. There. Ooh. You want to see that? There's a portal in it. Portal? There is too. Hey, let's go up there because that might link. That might link to that same tunnel. Because I know that there was several stops on that tunnel. Oh, because okay. Inca's been over here near a village doing villagers. Doing a few villagers. So this might take us into that tunnel and cut off the last leg of the Do trip. we need to remember that these things are not... You can't despawn a villager <laughs> <laughs> outpost. Like... Oh, look, there's like a, a ramp coming off the front of it. Oh, behind you. Oh. Hey, you were facing the other way, dude. Oh. <laughs> Shot. There's one over to your right as well, so just be right in the back. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you know what? Uh, they have LAs. I, I wonder if this is where they got the LAs. Yeah, right. Because uh, Inca and Cube both have LAs now. Ow. I have to remember I don't have infinity. I can't just waste all my arrows. What is with this thing of them them drawing their bow facing you and then as soon as I shoot they turn around and shoot me? When's that become a thing? <laughs> it's like I'm a... giving them little secret signals. <laughs> <laughs> behind you, behind you. <laughs> Got one of the bottles. Oh dear. Uh, eh, eh, eh. Oh no no no. I was gonna say don't, don't die all the way out here. Yeah, yeah, right. There's a bunch of guys behind us too, so this, we're getting in a, a bad get situation. Yeah, 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 yeah. I just want to get the guy with the flag. The I haven't got anything to build with, otherwise I would oh, I'm on one heart. Oh, no, get no, out of no, here, no. get out of yeah, here. Yeah, I'm dead. Go. Oh no, 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 no. Oh god, okay. I'm getting away from these guys. Okay. I'm guessing you're back at spawn. <laughs> you are guessing correctly. The great thing is that <laughs> test number one worked perfectly. Uh, spawn is beautiful. You spawn right in the middle of that uh, gorgeous oh, area. Awesome. So that's beautiful. Um, <clears throat> now. Okay, so I need to get all your stuff and not die from these guys. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Concentrate here. I don't need the crossbow. I need stuff. Unless you had a crossbow. I did not. I got your flowers. I got your flowers. Nice, oh, nice. Good, good. Let me get out of here. Yeah, you get out I'm of there. I have everything. Oh, I just fell off a cliff. Oh, no. Okay, I got I to gotta go over here and throw down my ender chest somehow. Oh, God. They, they just keep chasing you. They don't leave you alone. Yeah, here. no. Holy yeah. Cow. Yeah. Okay, so here's ender chest. And I'm pushing, I'm pushing. Welcome back. Thank you. Some stuff should be right over here. Ah, very good. Thank you. I mean, it's a very big, lukewarm ocean, which is just exciting in itself, really. I really it thought is. we were in with a chance. I really thought. I mean, there is a desert ahead of me. Maybe I should go across that desert and see what's on the other side. Oh, wow. Okay, I found another bit of lukewarm on this. <gasps> I found it! I found it! I found it! Did you? I found it. It's tiny. And I found it. And there's just, just a little bit of coral. And it's here. And... <laughs> Oda, we've done it. We are the heroes. <laughs> it's the smallest... <laughs> It's the smallest ocean ever known to man. Um, 
Did either of us bring, bring bone meal? No. No, neither of us brought bone meal. We're going to have to dig it up. <laughs> okay, I think you're lying. <laughs> no, I can see you. I'm looking straight at oh, you. Oh, there you are. There you are. <laughs> hey, there you are. Oh my gosh, that is tiny. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Let's see, does the water... Okay, so the water gets even, like, greener here. Or, like, more mm. bright. It's the top of the water. <laughs> One thing that's good is it's going to take them five minutes to despawn, but only three minutes for potions, so... Yep. Well, we did it, Odo. We, we are the heroes of the village. Look at, yes. look at, what a response. We got the coral, guys. We got we it. We got coral, everyone. Coral, coral. Anyone? Where is everyone? Eleven thousand blocks, Oda. There were deaths. There were there were great. I mean, ah, it's hard to be a hero sometimes. I guess not all heroes wear capes, Oda. We're just gonna have to be coral bros. Coral bros. Coral bros. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for coming. I'm glad we got it done. <laughs> Me too. This this was a fun adventure. Yeah, cool. Alrighty, I'll catch you later. Bye, Zink. See ya. I'm taking this coral. Yeah, I know. Me too. <laughs> now, one of the things that I wanted to do when I first decided where I was going to make my build um, was, for one, I knew that my style and Oda's style were going to be similar from the start. Um, and I wanted it to be somewhere where from, from spawn you could sort of see my build. It was always going to be, you know, one of the tallest builds on the on the server and things like that. And as you can see by looking around, you can't see my base. <laughs> my base is down here, hidden behind Oda's huge building. It is the tallest. Uh, so we don't have to worry about that, but uh, but it is hidden a little bit from uh, from spawn. Um, so we've gone with like a cathedral type thing, a, a churchy cathedral thing. It's good that Featherfetcher, um, he's one of the the newer members of the server. He built it. Um, he built nice and uh, gave a little bit of room there next to the build, so that um, at least from this angle, you know, you can see. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Um, yeah, I I like the way this has come out. This is a a nice sort of build. It's not finished yet, but this is as much as I'm going to do this week. Uh, so yeah, we've got the the glass stained window at the front there. We've got our nice little tower out the back there. Uh, gone with lots of little sort of shadowy details and things like that. Um, continuing on from what I do in my single player world so so dropping the deep slate in here and things like that so just underneath the edge so that it gives a bit of shadow um, I've done that thing with the chisel bookshelves in underneath there that gives a nice definitive line across the across the front I really like the look of that um, and gone with some fireplaces on the side I don't know how they stay up at this point I'm not sure whether they're going to need a, you know, something coming down. I mean, it's just an awning, so it's fine. Um, lots of details on the roof, um, some shading and things like that. In the tower itself, put lots of um, lots of sort of different different textures and things like that to to give that a bit of a look to the diorite on the outside of the glass. Um, and and originally I didn't like these gates, but now I do. I like the way they look with the the diorite. I think altogether that is really starting to look good. It's it's sort of got a real good feel to it. 
Um, all of Spawn is just looking so beautiful. Everyone's done such a magnificent job and it's always one of those things of stepping out and, and having a look at the way that people build and, and how they achieve what they're going for. People like Oda, um, let me move this. Oh, I've got no room in my inventory whatsoever. I don't know why I'm carrying around half of these things, but I am. We're going to discard some bones onto the ground there for the moment. Um, that didn't help me at all. Why Why would I throw that there? Oh, because I wanted the shield off there. That's right. Okay. Um, yeah, like Oda's build here is just beautiful. He's really, really outdone himself and, and done some gorgeous things with the way that his build is. Um, Isabox over here has built a nice little water tower that looks really cool. Um, let's, let's have a little bit of a look around. And E, Empress little bit here. Um, this upside down train cart. I love, love this. Um, I made fun of Toblox before, but Tobes always builds the most beautiful builds. It's, it's gorgeous. Millie over here. Uh, Cube has a building here. I love this that he's done this lettering and things like that. He's got a little forklift in here too that it looks like uh, it's like a naked odor is driving. Yes, he is. Um, yeah, so that's 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 where we're up to. This is this is Craftworks, and this is this is uh, season two has begun, and and that's what we've got. We've got a nice a nice building. The interior I've done very little on um, so far. Oh, I've got a dog with no name, but I, the dog does have leg warmers on, so it's probably I don't know. I don't know, some 80s, like Olivia Newton-John or something. It's it's Olivia, there you go. My dog is female, it's Olivia. Um, yeah, so so we've got just, just some very basic stuff in here and then up this temporary uh, thing, the, we've got the upstairs bit up here, so, so this is good. It'll be interesting to see what goes in across the road, if anything. Um, and no way, as usual, no way up into the tower for me. So, uh, yeah, that's that's where we're up to. Um, guys, before I have to sleep, I will say farewell. Um, thank you for joining me. And, boy, I'm looking forward to this season. Um, lots of new people, as I said. It's going to be fun to have some interactions with them as well as the old crafters as well. Um, and hope to see you again very, very soon. Uh, Friday will still happen. We will have a regular episode out on Friday. And, um, yeah, hopefully another Craftworks episode maybe next week. Have a great week, guys. I love you guys to death. You guys are the best. And I'll speak to you soon. See you later. Bye.